Hey guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Xu. Today I'd like to show you one of my favorite iPad apps that made my university life so much easier, especially when writing essays or reports, and that app is called Liquid Text. Essentially, this app is a PDF reader and it's really useful when you have to read so many articles and papers to write an essay or report or to prepare for your seminars or lectures. So, for example, let's say you need to write an essay about income inequality. Head to Google Scholar and type in some keywords, say so income inequality, and find some relevant articles that interest you. So, let's click this one by Kuznet. This essay looks interesting, so let's hit download and Download it to iCloud Drive or Google Drive, whichever you like. I'm gonna choose iCloud Drive and hit save. Okay, now I'm gonna find a few more articles. So, okay, now I got at least three articles in my iCloud. So I'm gonna head back to my iPad and open Liquid Text. So now I'm back on my iPad. Let's go to Liquid Text. So click here. Um, so I already have a bunch of folders, but let's make a new one. So new folder. Let's call it I don't know Macro. And inside the folder, click Open File. Here you can import the articles you just downloaded. So I had my articles in iCloud, so hit iCloud and select these three, uh, hit open. Okay, so now you have these three articles inside a folder, you can open them. Um, here's one of them and you can add the other two by clicking here and add and liquid text project. Where was I? Macro and um, HT, import VDF, and let's add the last one. Macro and this one. So now you have three articles open like this. You can start highlighting. So let's go to first article and highlight these yellow and what I love about this app is that you can drag and drop these highlights to the right hand and if you go to another article and say like highlight these and you can drag and drop like this it's quite useful especially when you have to read lots and lots of articles, like different articles, and you can drag and drop, and uh, it's kind of like a mind mapping. And also, if you want to see where these highlights come from, you can just click these blue arrows, like this, and it takes you back to where the highlights were. And also you can like use these pens, so you, have, you can write on the left-hand side, like this and you can also connect these two okay that's all for today um, if you like this video please leave a like or subscribe to the channel i'd really appreciate it and i'll see you in the next video bye